I, I mean, I still struggle with, you know, the losses that I've seen and decisions that I've made. Uh, Daniel Morgan is a 20 year U.S. Army veteran. I've watched uh, some horrific things, seen horrific things on the battlefield. I've had one of my closest friends fly in a helicopter. Uh, I didn't know he was in the helicopter at the time. I knew he was in the air. There were only two of them and I watched it get shot down and I knew whoever was in that helicopter at the time that they were obviously gone. Morgan has seen things he wishes he could unsee, felt losses he wishes on no one. When the Twin Towers fell on September 11th, scores of first responders rushed to the scene of the devastation. It's with that desire he is now working to make a difference in the lives of Gold Star families through a national nonprofit called Tuesday's Children, work that begins when the rest of the world shifts its focus away. Coming from a military family as a Gold Star family, and you lose your soldier, um, you are now, you know, fairly isolated in a lot of ways. Morgan, who has seen firsthand families change forever, says Tuesday's children promises to help find a path to long-term healing amid grief that will never go away. Tuesday's children. Morgan promises every Gold Star family and veteran, you aren't alone. We, we are here for you. You have an ear, you have empathy to give you those things that you need to bring your, your children and your family you know, to a better future uh, to be able to provide for themselves and for each other. There have been more than 20 Temple, Barry Roy, Six News. Leaving many thousands of widows and some 60% of children who lost an active duty military parent are under the age of 20.